Irish priest. Yeah, my name's Harvey Richard. Oh, hello, Harvey Richard. How are you doing, sir? Hi. Yeah, I'm well, thank you. I'm well. Fantastic. Uh, Harvey Richard, uh, how, how would you like to be addressed by? Uh, just call me Richard, that's fine. Richard, thank you very much, Richard. Yeah. You're making me comfortable already. Richard, I've just got a couple of... Uh, couple of questions. I'm basically doing a bit of research for a project that I have and I speak to quite a few people regarding Christianity as I do take a massive interest in Christianity and speaking to Christians. And um, sure. I've just got a few questions. I wanted to know if I could borrow like three or four minutes of your time if possible. Yeah, go ahead. Fantastic, yeah. Richard. So I'm just going to race through these questions. They've been already preset for me, so I'm just reading them out as they've okay. already been given to me. Yeah? yeah. Okay, so the first one and then I'll race through them. So who is God? Yep. Uh, that's a good question. <laughs> well, God is God. Uh, <laughs> uh, Jesus Christ is, is, Jesus is God. Is God, yeah. uh, okay. God is Trinity. Yeah. Oh, okay. And is Jesus the son of Mary? Yes. And who created Mary? Uh, God created Mary. And what is God's name? Uh, well, Yahweh or Lord. Or Jesus? But Jesus, yeah. Or Jesus. Okay. And Jesus is the Bogotan son of God? Okay, and who is his father? Uh, God the Father. And who is God the Father? Uh, God the Father is the first person of the Trinity. Okay, and who, yeah. is, and who is God Jesus? The second person of the Trinity. Okay, and is Jesus the servant of God? Yes. And did Jesus die on a cross? Yes. And Jesus is God, yes? Yeah. And who resurrected Jesus? God as well. Okay, so God resurrected God. Okay, let me just write this down. And um, is Jesus a messenger? Yeah, he's um, one of his um, titles is prophet of God. Yeah, prophet, messenger, messenger. God. fantastic. Okay, and who sent him? I'm sorry? And who sent Jesus, the God Jesus? Uh, God the Father. Okay, yeah. so God sent God. Okay, and who is, uh, and did Jesus worship while on earth? Okay, and who was Jesus? Uh, who was God? Jesus worshiping? Uh, God, his father. Okay, yeah. so God was worshiping God. Okay, and um, and does God? Did God have a beginning? God has no beginning. No. Okay, fantastic. So when was Jesus born? Uh, well, uh, in approximately um, three BC, we now think. Yeah, two thousand years ago. Yeah. So God has no beginning. What day of birth? 25th of December. Okay. And where is God? Uh, well, good question. God is omnipresent. omnipresent. Um, so he is everywhere. Okay. Is there is there any disclaimer to that question? Or does that mean that God is absolutely everywhere? So... Um, well, God is everywhere. God is omnipresent. But um, I suppose that heaven is reckoned to be the dwelling place of God. Okay. And where is Jesus? Okay, and who was it that sent Jesus to heaven? Um, well, he was ascended by the power of God, his Father. Okay, fantastic. Nearly done, Richard. Thank you very much. And how many gods are there in heaven? Just the one. Just the one, yeah. And where is Jesus? Heaven. Okay, and um, is he sitting next to God in heaven, as said in the Bible? He's the right hand of the Father, yeah. Okay, so how many seats are there in heaven? <laughs> uh, the book of Revelation uh, talks about there being 12 thrones yeah. for, um, for the 12 um, tribes of Israel. Yep. Okay, so is that, are they all 12 gods? Uh, no, not, not in the common understanding, no. Okay, interesting. Okay, and um, so Jesus is city, sitting next to God, yeah? Yeah. Is his seat a different kind of seat to God's seat? Are they the same size? Are they made from the same material? Okay. Um, how many would be seated on one chair? I mean, if there's there's twelve seats, as you said, um, yeah. it rings about to another kind of religious theory as well. But just for the just for the point, argument's sake. Um, so there's yeah, I think one 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 seat equals one one god. So yeah. one seat equals one god, yeah. So twelve yeah. times one is twelve gods. Okay, cool. And um, so so and in order to get the Holy Ghost in you, um, how do you go about doing that? 
because I, I do understand that as a Christian you need the Holy Ghost in order to understand Christianity, correct? Yes, yeah, well the Holy Spirit is given as God's gift to us, um, okay. the chief um, uh, means by which one receives the Spirit is through baptism. Oh, okay, and wh which one of the of the gods are on those chairs is giving them the gift? Um, and, uh, well, the, the gift of the Holy Spirit in baptism is the gift of God Himself. Okay, and um, so in the Bible, do you know what it says in Corinthians fourteen thirty three off the top of your head? One Corinthians fourteen thirty three. Oh, I yeah. think that off the top of my head. Okay, so basically what I've got here is that it says God is not the author of confusion. Uh, would you agree yeah. with this statement? I would, yeah. Okay, fantastic. And finally, just one more question, and thank you very much for your patience, Richard. Um, do you know what uh, Jesus said to his people in Luke, in uh, the chapter of Luke, 2436? Luke 2436. Um, uh, it will be near the end of Luke. Um, yeah. Do you like me to help you out, Richard? If you've got it there. Yeah, yeah. that's fine. Uh, well, got it in got it in memory. So in Luke 24, 36, Jesus turned to his people and he yeah. said, Peace be with you. Do you know yeah. do you know by any chance what peace be with you is translated to in Arabic? In Arabic? Yeah. Um Peace be with you. Um No, is that something is that like Salam al or something like that? Richard, I'm very impressed by you. And do you know which yeah. uh, do you know which uh, religion actually greets with each other with Assalamu alaikum? Yeah, that's Islam. Okay. And could you quote me? Do you know off the top of your head where in the Bible it says that Jesus fell to his uh, with his face to the floor praying to God? Um, yeah, that's in the agony in Gethsemane. Fantastic. Um, you're, you're very sharp, yeah. Richard. Fantastic. And do you know which religion do you know which religion actually promotes this type of worship, where you put your head to with your face to the floor? Yeah. Fantastic. And you and you live in Shepherd's Bush, right? I do, yeah. Yeah. Fantastic, Richard. Richard, thank you very much. Um, and I really appreciate your time. And uh, just to let you know, my name is Muhammad. I'm a Muslim and I speak to ah, Christians. Uh, nice to meet you, Muhammad. Yourself too, Richard. It's been a pleasure. What I would love to do, Richard, if if it is at, at actually possible with yourself, is to one day to come in and have a chat with you. I don't know if you would be happy with this, but if you would, I would come at your obviously your time, your discretion time and, and whatnot and whatever's comfortable for yourself. How would you feel about uh, that? I'm always open to discussions with people, yeah, that's part of my job as the parish priest. Yeah. Fantastic. Well, I mean, what I want to do just to, to give you some comfort and just to keep on the same theme of this conversation, I would love to greet you the way that Jesus greeted his people. So that's peace be with you, I guess, right? Yes, peace be with you. Yeah. Thank you very much, Richard. You well, have a good day. Wa alaikum as salam, you would say yes. Yeah. So may Allah guide you, Richard. Thank you very much for your time. Okay, Take care now. You. Bye. Bye. <laughs> أهل الكتاب لا تغلوا في دينكم ولا تقولوا على الله إلا الحق إنما المسيح عيسى بن مريم رسول الله وكلمته ألقاها إلى مريم وروح منه فآمنوا بالله ورسله ولا تقولوا ثلاثا انتهوا خيرا لكم إنما الله إله واحد سبحانه أن يكون له ولد له ما في السماوات وما في الأرض وكفى بالله وكيلا